good for my dehydration. And the cure is where it's going to start me back off. <clears throat> of course, right out here outside of the damn house. Greetings, Master. Hear about the contract. Really got an imp problem? Or is that just an imp perfection in the notice? You ought not jest, Master Witcher. I know the creatures are only to exist in fairy tales, yet I saw one with my own eyes as it stole from my store. Alright, so what's this imp look like? Like a mean, fat cat, but a very large one. Uh, this tall, see? And it walked upon its hind paws. What did it swipe from you? Once it was bread, uh, then a fish, then apples. Might not seem like much, but add it together and the business suffered. And I'm hardly alone in being pestered. It's nicked something from every stand in the square. So... Will you teach it a lesson with your silver sword? Make it worth my while and I will. Demand for witches is high, supplies low. 
I pick and choose my contracts these days. A bit much, but the compromise is in sight. A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. Oh, bitch. Fine negotiation on your part, Master. So be it. We'll call it agreed. Relax. I'll help you. Small businesses are the foundation of a healthy economy. So on and so on. Thank you, Master Witcher. I don't know if this will be of use, but most recently the thief leapt over that wall and ran into a passageway. It was the last I saw of him and a few of my wares. <laughs> Merchant was right. Actually does look like a giant cat. Hmm. Anything else? And, um, what the fuck is there with his footprints spacing out and shit? And you go down. Oh. Goddamn. Can't jump that damn far. Where do we go from there? Looks like the imp dropped some loot. Hmm. Definitely came through here. Uh, her? Drop down into the moat. Trail ends here. Jump off into the back. <laughs> or if you hit the rocks, because you can't fucking see. <sighs> One of the few deaths. I think I've died more to Fallen than I have anything else. <laughs> There's several in the beginning. Kind of judge how far you can actually fall. <sighs> Should have had my shield on. First, I was thinking it was that little goblin chick. <clears throat> she's got to eat too, I think. Something with some big ass paws. But apparently. Apparently it's like two foot tall. <laughs> it's Shaquille O'Neal's shoes. 
merchants, robbing the damn merchants. <laughs> the Sasquatch. The midget Sasquatch. <laughs> That's why Sasquatches don't fuck doors. Merchant was right. Actually, does look like a giant cat. Okay, got it. Looks like the imp dropped some loot. Hmm. Definitely came through here. Dropped down into the moat. Trail ends here. Let me go around, I think. Hello. Burning up candles and shit like they're free. A woman's blouse, a man's shirt, a child's shoes, but only one bed. Lavender, strong scent. Have to track him down. Gotcha, bitch. Racist here has demanded to search me for no reason at all. Use a non human, I need no other reason. Lucky I didn't find anything on you. Now piss off to the woods, go play your flute. That was some pretty bad acting. Really ought to explore other career options. Petty theft, maybe. You dare insult an officer on duty? Let me give you some advice, mutant. Look who's talking. I know you're a Doppler and a kleptomaniac. Merchants put out a contract on me. <sighs> Always the same old shit. <laughs> hey, wait. Come here, stupid. Should have turned back into that cat to run away, you dumbass. Really want to see an angry witcher. Do you? Get 
hurt. Please stop. I <clears throat> surrender. Might be able to look like a witcher. Won't make you fight like one. Yeah, Johnny, your skin's enough to know what kind of man you are. What you feel. spare you, but you gotta help me in return. I need you to assume someone's form, Caleb Mengas. I need you to sail the Temple Isle and... What? I'll not do it. I'd never do it. You might as well kill me now. Save me the torture Menga would put me through. Fine. Never mind. Just stop stealing, or I'll torture you myself. I'll but... get lost. <laughs> no. No. No, if he's not doing my favor, he's gonna fucking die. That's what the fucking. Spare a cop or two. Motherfuck. There's something in the wind. <laughs> I got something you can put wind on. So now I'm not gonna get paid by the goddamn merchant either. On well, side note, with this telekinetic bullshit, can I just run around robbing everybody? Hey, how much money you got in your pocket? Give it here. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> like contract's done. He's dead. I showed you his head. Pay me. Problem solved. Convince the imp to go back to the countryside to tangle horse manes and piss in milk, as tradition ordains. And how would I know you speak the truth? No trophy, no reward. There better be one, or you'll feel the invisible hand of the market smack you so hard you won't be able to sit down for a week. I'll give you half the agreed sum, no more, and I'll not do business with you again. It Greetings, Stay away. Greetings, master. I smacked a fucking taste out of your mouth and take the rest of my money. If I can go get a blue screen again. <clears throat> Should just kill that fucker. Who the fuck? Really, you retard? Change out of your underwear if we go trying to fuck around, folks. Alright. Oh, yeah, the crooked ass house. Still 
get in the water. Sir. Yes, Gal? What did you want to talk about? I got a strange message. I didn't quite know what to think. Who was it from? Ingrid Vagelbutt's servant. Apparently, Lady Vagelbutt's prepared to donate a tidy sum. She wants to help mages escape from Novigrad. Guessing this wouldn't be a selfless act of charity. You guess right. And that's my problem. Vagelbud needs a favor from me. No details in a letter, unfortunately. I'm supposed to meet the servant at the fish market. Says he needs to explain everything face to face, but these days I can't be sure meeting him is a good idea. Fish market, Trace. Be able to get you some salted cod at best. It could be better if I talk to the mystery man. Get you some salted cod. You just wait nearby. I'll make sure that note didn't come from the witch hunters. Then you come in. Mm -hmm. Fine. Let's meet there. <laughs> I now have 100 waters. <laughs> Calm your tits. Yeah. Still can't help but feel like an errand boy. choice from the beginning. Thank you. 
Okay, bye. Oh my god, why is it every time I go to loot fucking bodies to get in a cutscene? What did they want from you? Oh, no clue. First time I've laid eyes on you. Maybe. Well, recently someone's been trying to question our messengers about the young count. Hold on. Where's Miss Merigold? You would come alone, Miss. If not for him, that trio would have dragged you in for questioning. The tall one was Valdo Morris. Works for the witch hunters. Aye, you're surely right, Miss. I, I, it just worked what I expected since Lady Bagel, bud. So what's this about? Be straight. Lady Bagel, bud's son. He's the problem. Master Albert's taken an interest in alchemy. Temple guards got the win. Wouldn't worry about the guard. But since the mage hunters tried to grab you, I'd say Albert's in serious trouble. Aye. Lady Vogelbutt bought off the guardsmen. Since the hunters paid for every mage revealed you. Guardsmen took a bribe from the frightened family, and whispered a word to the hunters anyway. Seems Albert needs to disappear as soon as possible. I can arrange that. Think young Vogelbutt can slip out of the house unnoticed? Tain't that simple, sadly. Master Albert's in hiding at the Bagel Bud's country estate. Lady Ingrid's got the notion she can get him out quietly. Want to throw a lavish masquerade ball. Am I supposed to attend? Help him escape? I will not manage without you, miss. Lady Bagel Bud fears the help's being watched. It's a good idea. A boisterous bash that'll distract the hunters. Especially if even half of what I've heard about the Vagelbud's balls is true. Word is, at the last one they served a hundred different desserts, and the fireworks boomed from dusk till dawn. What with the war and all, my lady's ordained but 85 desserts this time. Won't be no candy petals or blue roses from the Zed. The roses have become dreadfully hard to come by. Oh, I'd love to see it all. I hope we won't have to stay till the end. And you're coming with me? Of course I am. I'm not about to send you into what could prove to be the lion's den by yourself. Think about it. 85 desserts. While well, you're still trying to keep your waist at 22 inches. Carol, please. How do we get to the residence? <laughs> your invitation. Take it. Go <laughs> I'm going to make sure you don't get fat, bitch. <laughs> wear a cosmos, right? Good 85 answer. desserts. <laughs> what kind of shit? <laughs> Think we can head there now? You're kidding, right? We have to prepare. Change clothes. Most importantly, buy our masks. I bet you can get everything we need for the ball at Eliel's shop. You know it? No. Been there before. Eliel's a friend of Dandelion's. Just masks, right? Probably don't need to wear a doublet, do I? A doublet, Geralt. And it's not up for discussion. Take care of that and come see me. I'll just go as this. <laughs> like, look, I'm supposed to be a witcher. <sighs> Optional by the other outfit. I ain't doing it. Spend my money on some kind of armor and weapon tree that I don't know where all my money goes to. <laughs> Not the masquerade balls. Just the Trini Elf. Oh my god, it is. <laughs> Not the Trini Elf. Come to look over my spring collection, perhaps? Oh god. Glad to take a glance at what you got. Of course, please do. If anything chafes or pinches, I can alter it on the spot at no charge. I bet Once you I'm done, can. it'll feel like you're wearing nothing at all. <laughs> feel like I'm wearing what? Lucky, say.
so long. Greetings. Come to look over my spring collection, perhaps? <laughs> it's actually kind of fitting with the cat ass coming through the fox mask, I guess. Glad to take a glance at what you got. Of Looks course, please do. If anything chafes or pinches, I can alter it on the spot at no charge. Once I'm done, it'll feel like you're wearing nothing at all. There goes a quest I was going to go Of course, please do. If anything ch- So long. Shit, I went wrong way. You know who's not getting the plague? I'm not getting the plague. Somewhere in my bird mask. Oh, somebody else is in the broadcast. You'd even look great wearing a bustle. Dad, I want to know what that is. For now, you'll just have to survive on bread and a witcher. Well, then. Shall we go? <laughs> I'm wearing a mask and this blue top. <laughs> Close as it's getting.
Let's see what kind of shit we get into in this ball. Greetings, my lord, my lady. We're Lady Ingrid Vagelbutt's guests. Your invitation, please. It's in order. You'll find Lady Vagelbutt in the estate's yard. Look for the parrot mask. Now, one more thing. Found the parrot mask. Leave your swords here, please. Make certain every guest enters the estate unarmed. Damn it. <laughs> a pleasant right. evening to you both. <laughs> That's fine, I will punch a bitch to death. I haven't been outside the city in ages. Oh my god. This stupid PlayStation Network, I swear to god. Jesus Christ. Hello. No use pretending you good. I guess our other visitor already left. Is that any way to treat an old mate? Refuse to acknowledge the him? The fuck are you wearing a boot? I don't know you, sir. Don't be foolish, Vivian. I'd recognize that maid anywhere. You might play the great dame now, but before that Baron Edward something pulled you from the gutter, you were a common. Enough. The lady said she doesn't know you. Who's this? The new one? Older than the last, it seems. A decrepit, moss-covered prick. So, the less they can, the more they pay. <laughs> uh, fuck it. You asked for it. <laughs> Still finna get fuck. <laughs> Fisty cuffed. Oh. You like that bitch? We weren't supposed to draw any attention. What? Bitch no, ass motherfucker. Work here, you know. Goddamn, try my patience. <laughs> You're cracking? What? <laughs> Wait, there's a side mission in here. <laughs> side mission is don't knock anybody, slap the fuck out. <laughs> ah, shit. What Wait, what the fuck? What well, the fuck? Uh, now you finna get knocked out too? Wearing my mask. Yes, I missed you too. But can we put that aside for now? Do you have a way out of Novigrad? You can join us if you want. Trace, not what we're here for. No, it's exactly what we're here. Well, Moritz? Join you. And just who would I join? Your friends, among others. Once we've all gathered, I'll lead you. You will leave. Forgive me, Marigold, but that is like allowing myself to be led by a lame duck. Farewell. <sighs> this dude. Everybody trying to get knocked out here? <laughs> Who is that? He's an old friend. His name's Moritz Dyfenthal. I'll tell you the story later. Mm hmm. <laughs> Can't help feel a little, little bit jealous about this old fuckboy over here. I don't know what the hell is going on with it. Is this shit inside? I gotta be inside. Is this the same motherfucker? I wish you were cold. Let's look around. Let's not look around. Let's go over here. Oh, what you got? Ah, another challenger. Please join us. Ooh. Sir Debenham just vacated his place at the table. It's rather unlikely he'll be back. What happened to him? 
Some good men took him aside to prevent him from hurting himself. So, shall we play? First, you shall face Margrave Vladimir de Cray. The man can afford to lose, so he's likely to be reckless. God damn it. <laughs> Not in the mood. <laughs> Not in the mood to win. <laughs> in the mood to knock someone the fuck out. Gregor, have you seen Durgoth? Holy Just a shit. <laughs> Apologies, I mistook you for my friend, sir. He wears a similar mask. General Voris. Geralt of Rivia, so I was not entirely mistaken. Pleasure, as always. <laughs> this is a beautiful and mysterious lady. Let us leave the formalities to the event's end when all will remove their masks. More fun that way, wouldn't you agree? I would, sir. And now I must beg your pardon. I really must find Durgoff and quickly. A lovely evening to you both. <laughs> hey, what's the point wearing the mask and everybody fucking knows who we are here? <laughs> I got pushed around. <laughs> you fucked. <laughs> At this rate, by the time my character is like, it's gonna Excuse plaster me. somebody to a wall. Miss? Yes, it's me. The trout fire. <laughs> so these mutton chops oh, were meant for grabbing on to. Agreeing to help. My valet warned me you might come with a friend. I'd prefer as few as possible new of Albert's flight. So a friend? But you have a threesome? You man, but... Like no one else. Any sign of the hunters recently? Since they attacked my servant at the market, none. All has been quiet. But I bribed a man of the temple guard. He claims there's more and more talk of Albert in the ranks. How did the guardsmen learn about your son's interests to begin with? <sighs> Unfortunately, I cannot be sure Albert himself was not the sole experiment. He's careless that way. Like his father. A kind man, but a dimwit. Devoured by an Arrakis. I don't know if you've heard. Yeah. Must have traveled far and wide. Hardly. He attempted to breed them. Perhaps I should be pleased Albert adopted alchemy as his hobby, a safe one, relatively speaking, until recently, that is. Let's go. Let's get Albert. Where is he? Entertaining the guests. He's always been an outsized presence at my receptions. I preferred not to arouse any suspicions. When can we take him away? We shall have to wait until the guests have imbibed enough to notice only the goblet-laden trays. Don't fret. It won't be long. He's donned a panther mask. He knew you were due to come for him. Seems rather excited, ironically. I'm afraid he's not fully comprehended the danger he faces. As I said, he's not terribly bright. Don't worry about that. He'll fit right in with a good number of the other mages. <laughs> Let's go find him. I should have worked on him. Careful. <laughs> A motherfucker in a panther mask, okay? <laughs> so you at Black Panther? Uh, a lot of motherfuckers here not even wearing masks, though. What the fuck? What's that? No. Yeah, bitch. Oh, they 
do have stairs. striking me as wearing a panther mask other than at the first circle which I wasn't sure if that was him or not knucklehead at yes darling Albert Vagelbud fume my sweet I can be Adolf Valentino <laughs> okay so not him they didn't specify what fucking color. Half these motherfuckers ain't wear a mask over here. Okay, and I didn't really see anybody over at this. Ah, uh, there he is. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> nice mask. Got <laughs> 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 yeah, a real winner here. Albert Vagelbud. No. <laughs> I am a black panther. <laughs> Mr. Panther. Oh, so you are. <laughs> I'm a Black Panther. Rawr. Yes, when can we leave the estate? Well, Mama said it would be best to wait until everyone's drunk. Besides, there'll be fireworks later. A jolly good distraction. Once they've begun, I shall slip away, saunter into the garden. Meet in the hedge maze. Be waiting for you there. Very well. But first, you absolutely must try the Fiorano Rose. Absolutely. <laughs> Hope Albert hasn't forgotten the reason for this whole get together. Wanna wait in the garden? I saw a nice spot there earlier. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> dessert or dessert? Up, where is all the food? Eh. Found it. Oh. Some grapes or something, bitch. This ain't the dessert table, but you ain't going to the dessert table. to sit on my face. I mean, in my lap. I mean, on beside me. Relieved to get that mask off. If only for a little. Great view from here. And there's even wine. It's been so long since I've been to a feast, ball, or reception. And maybe <coughs> we to change from the sewers of Novograd. <laughs> so, does this mean it's a good time to ask you about... Yes? About that mage we met earlier? Ah. Uh, Moritz, what do you want to know? Got the impression he doesn't exactly like you. I just think he'd love to have me as his charge, rather than his leader. See, but you're the one organizing the mage's escape from Novigrad. Sometimes I have no idea how I actually managed to bring them all together. 
So you know what else we're gonna bring together? Those titties. Personal charm. That's what it's about. <laughs> Careful, that sounded like a compliment. Glad it did. Oh. Are you trying to... Someone's coming. <laughs> Is it Albert? No, just some lost guest. Shh. <laughs> Must be looking for his beloved. Like in that elven tale about the frog and the lark. Inchu, inchu, biag broga. Inch by inch, little frog. <laughs> Shh, let's go. Oh. <laughs> I sure hope the other guests don't get drunk as quickly as I did. <laughs> so they may be so we get out of here, the better. I <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. a glass of wine. <laughs> Shazar's getting naked in the woods. Said something about naked. Well, Carol, coming? Glass of wine, she gets all rapey. Eh. <laughs> Reflex boner. There's the fireworks, so we should probably be <laughs> getting old buddy. Miss Miracle, at last. So sorry we are forced to meet under such incredibly inopportune circumstances. Right, you can say that again. <laughs> but I'm sure we'll make up for it another time. I absolutely must show you my alchemical formulae. Anyone follow you? I don't believe so. Just in case, you two switch masks. <laughs> as long as you don't go we'll kissing this mask again. <laughs> Saddled horses away to the stables. Good. Meet you there. <laughs> yeah, outside of the mask we look completely the same. <laughs> I am the panther now. Rawr. <laughs> I'll go back up here and act retarded. I want to paint no. You promised to show me your laboratory. Albert, you are my love. Yes, 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 I'm here. Here you are. <laughs> so, about this private show. Under any other circumstances, I'd give you the full monty. Oh, I, I'm sorry, I. <laughs> Hello. Albert Vega, please step away, miss. The ability is not towards your count. Try anything, and you will get moved. Doubt it. <laughs> Somebody figured not a bug out. Alright, man. Hey, you man. Oh, there we go. Ha, <laughs> get fucked. Ah, surprise, I got you again. <laughs> Where the fuck did you go? Just 
stupid. Treasures in here before. Oh well, kind of was. Yeah, that's the wrong way. Nope, nope. See any other shit hidden in here? Do 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 do. Dumb twats really went as far as the or it's the dude in the panther mask. And that was like all the description they got. Oh, I began to worry. Everything's fine, though you should probably send someone to uh, clean up the garden before any guests wander in there. I'm to send servants to the garden. Yes. I shall see to it. And you must hurry. Everything set? Yes. Got your swords back from the guard. And Ingrid gave me the coin. It's, it's more than I expected. Stunningly more, frankly. Excellent. So where are we going to get away to? You? Nowhere. What happened at the fountain? It was my fault. I know. The, the wine went straight to my head. I'm sorry. Tris, don't apologize. Miss Marigold. We need to go. I know. Be careful. <laughs> she's, like she's about a quarter inch away from nipples popping out. Still trying to figure out how the fuck do you ride a horse sideways. There's a fast travel right there. Go, go, gadget, back to town. <clears throat> so I'm supposed to help find that dude's treasure or some shit too, or not sure why he needs my help. He figured out all the same information I got. Like have your spies find the damn vault? I don't know. Since maybe when you realize he was spending a bunch of money and you lost a bunch of money, you should have somebody follow him. I don't know. Move on. Good 
Wait a minute. Forever and ever now. This house of flight. They seek to burn the city down. What the fuck is this? Ah, oh. another drifter in from Tamaria. Yeah. This is what like where bombs or some shit go. What the fuck is it taking me? Oh yeah, the underneath bullshit. Yeah, bitch. To the bathhouse. Orson's neck deep in shit. So it seems reliable. Hmm. It would certainly explain how he had the nerve to break with the Big Four. Need someone who can get me in to see Junior. He must still have some contacts among the Redanians. I don't, but you do. Enlighten me. Temerian, former commander of the Blue Stripes. Ring a bell. Ring a roach. He's holed up with his men in the camp near Oxenford. Pay him a visit. You're sure to cheer him up at least. I don't want to go. I'd like to hear about masquerade party. This is where we get back into the way I was talking about running around and getting all this shit unlocked. <laughs> Did you watch all these fuckers with torches running around? White honey potion. I was talking about the cancel potion effects and lower fucking toxicity. Drink the white honey potion or whatever. Talk to that other herbalist chick. Yeah. I 
Come here, bitches. The white wolf. Looking for Roach. No one here by that name. Anything else? I see. And behind you, that's a berry picker's camp? We're, uh, bird watchers. Let me guess. That sword's in case you run into a hornbill. No. Hornbills aren't endemic to this area. Don't migrate here either. Gonna walk in the camp now. Aye. Naturally. And you're gonna go look for hornbills. Aye. I'm going, indeed. <laughs> Okay, bye. <laughs> Let's be aware of the other side of the river. One horse move. Geralt of the Safe and Sound. Burning Roach. <laughs> That's not a crossbow. That's a crossbow. Not all you want. To marry a will rise again. Roach, I cannot abandon them. <laughs> Hello. You can and must. Because those are your orders. They'll die. Please. We're done. Dismissed. <laughs> Can I trade Triss? I seen her eye on me. <laughs> like all these bitches eye on me. They scared to do something. Oh, I guess. Yeah. Looking for a horse and junior. I've heard of it. Well, I'm not sure why you think you might be in my camp. Heard some birds chirping. You've got some of the same friends. Both seem to count Radovid among your allies. These birds. They're terribly talkative. I'll need to see them. You'll have to point them out. Mm -hmm. Meantime, Vernon. Willing to help or do I need to keep looking? Mm. As always, you've more luck than you deserve. I'm on my way to meet my Redanian contact. We're meeting near Oxford. Chess Thanks. Knew I could count on you. <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> Two blades. Using on this shit like poison, stun, freeze. Man, I know you had burning on some of them. Try that out. This is a three percenter. Can I get to where I'm trying to go?
Alright, better mutagens. Hey. Okay. Shit's still there looking for hornbills. That's it, Roach. <laughs> Stupid. Can I put my goddamn trap down? Treasure or anything around here? Just sort of fucking ass chilling. And fit. Come on now. Hey, no match. Ready? My contact awaits at the chess club. Let's get this over. Come on. <laughs> See, we trade crossbows. His shit shooting fucking bull sticks. Shooting lawn darts. Something's not right. Let's see what. <laughs> I think it's my fox mask. the game of kings. The chess teaches one to think strategically. What a load of rubbish. 
Both sides have identical pieces. The rules stay invariably the same. How does this mirror <coughs> life? Witcher. Do you know why I play chess? <laughs> so people don't catch on that you look retarded when you look at them? To spend time in good company? A king cherishes no one's company. Not a king that stays king very long there. To reveal the game's secret. Blood thumps inside these chessmen. You need only listen. And you will hear. Dup dup. Dup dup. Dup dup. A heart pumping with life. How much shit have you smoked? I take a pawn, and I hear flesh being rent. I win a piece, and I hear screams from the depths of its bowels. I want to break the chessmen open, squeeze the truth from them. You see what I mean? Yes, sire, I believe I do. You know shit. You're merely humoring me. I was not speaking literally. First hidden truth. A monarch is always surrounded by fools. Understand? Nope, still don't get it. Unimportant. Let us speak. Why have you brought the Witcher here? I think he best explain. I'm looking for Cyprian Wiley, Orson Jr. I know Redania supports him. Why do you seek him? It's personal. Fair enough. I'll not pry. I have placed Julia in a mansion in Oxenfurt. Very few know this. They'll not let you in unannounced. Thus, you must tell them you've come about the new horse. Junia constantly requests fresh women. I hear he doesn't treat them well. You just give me a man after investing coin and time in him? Can't help but wonder why. Consider it a gesture of goodwill. Almost. I'll expect you to return the favor. And also, Junior has lost his purpose. The Big Four is no more. I shall contact you to collect in due course. Now go. And you, Roach. We must speak another time. <laughs> well, we cast that dude aside pretty quick. The deeper into madness, as I see it. I know where to find Junior. Don't really care beyond that. <laughs> so we're like a Come to homeboy's pretty quick to, to throw away some people. Had a terrible problem with Bessie. Need someone to like, talk oh, to. Oh, he's in the house in Oxford. Just go over and ask him about the horse. Oh, take him out there. Let me think what? about it. See you, Roach. Yeah, I didn't ever talk to that shit yet. Eh, fuck him. Oh, I 
fucking duck hand running around with gloves and fucking boxers on. <laughs> I'm here to get the fish. <laughs> like, what the fuck are you doing with these fish? <laughs> so why do they weigh a little bit more when you get done doing whatever it is? Right. I hear about the whores. What do you want? Where's Horson Jr.? Oh, this one's got bollocks, don't it? I know you, you motherfucker. Saw you kill old guy that big. Uh, must be a misunderstanding. Flank the bastard! It's fucked up, bro. I got the key, bitch. Knock, knock. <laughs> oh, really, you fucking cocksucker? Dinner's ready. How about get it? Got your toes. <laughs> this little piggy went to market. your nose. I bet you're inside with the horse. Yeah. Set here. Oh. 
That might be an interesting Google search. This is Horson Jr.'s residence. I think this is uh, that other dude's place. Your senses or some stupid shit. It's fucking pretty. Junior, I've come to talk. I'll do whatever you want. Got a few questions to start with. I'll tell you everything. I'm looking for a young woman and a minstrel. I know you've met them. Ugh. What fucking put them? Ashen here with a sword on her back, just like me. Yeah, yeah. Ugh. That was... I, I, I remember. Pay attention now. You'll tell the truth. Wanna know why? I won't lie. Honest. Took me a long time to find you. Wasn't an easy road to travel. I'm angry and tired. Had to kill a lot of people along the way. 
Some of them tried to cheat me. Some tried to lie. I didn't like it one bit. I feel like one more lie to be the last bitter drop in a chalice full of sorrow. And then, then I'd do something I would later regret. Now you know why you can't lie to me? Yes. Good. I'd like to know how the ashen-haired woman ended up meeting you, and what happened to her. What happened to her? She attacked me! Lie one more time, and I'll cut your balls off. <laughs> We've made a deal. I was to repair their magic, filler what's it. The girl and the songster were to bring me Siggy Ruvin's treasure. They did, so I might have flown off the handle a bit, I admit. What did you do? I nabbed their flunky, Dodo. I'm waiting for them to come for him. Look, this. Here's what they wanted fixed. A phylactery? You can fix something like this? Not me. I know a guy. Wasting my time, Junior. I need details. I'll tell you, tell you all. Just the way it ended. I actually chose not to kill him, to talk to him, <laughs> so I just started beating his ass. That's one of the four gangster dudes in whatever town that was. We got a bunch of crazy henchmen. Huh? Yeah, I was in the mask. <clears throat> He's the one that's got all the fucking henchmen wearing clown masks and boxers and shit. Got a bad feeling about this. Calm down, Dandelion. You can't leave Dudu in Horse and Junior's hands, you know that. I know, I know, but my gut can't be reasoned with. And no amount of sympathy I feel can silence it, blot it out. Get a grip, Dandelion. We must focus on the task at hand. I'm just saying. Well, then be silent. Have you learned where Horson is keeping Dudu? Room on the top floor. One with the balcony. I'll need to cross onto the roof. Wait for me in front of Junior's house. And I know it's difficult, but do try to look inconspicuous. If they... If they hurt you, Horson will pay. Must go onto the roof. <laughs> so I got this strange feeling Dandelion ain't really about shit, though. It's all a little threats. Room on the top floor. One with the balcony. There's the balcony. Let's see what's inside. And now, my dear Dodo, I believe I'll try a different two. Fray that board with this one. You're fucking balmy, Junior! Anyone tell you that? No. Most say I'm nice. Once they get to know me. So, you enjoy good company? Like to make new acquaintances? <laughs> you plan to introduce me to someone interesting? There you are. Good of you to come. I've been waiting for you. Wait a minute. I gotta beat his ass twice. <laughs> yeah, she didn't know mine either. Got you. 
He's getting his ass whooped by every witcher that is in this whole fucking map, huh? <laughs> They're coming! Dudu, listen. This is what we'll do. Fight better with her. <laughs> oh, she'll be. I figure this part out with her. I'm not sure. Since I'm out of ability, oh, he uses energy. So that don't make no sense. So if we rescued the fucking dude who hit, how the fuck, I guess they recaptured his ass? <laughs> dude who ain't good at getting away from people. <laughs> so that dude's probably got like, that dude's probably got like one goon left and he didn't capture dude again. <laughs> so there you are, dude. Come here. Like, oh shit. Waddle away. I beg you. Got what I deserve. Have mercy. Please. Mm, yeah, you're dying for the dead huggers. where things stand. I'm looking for this woman because she's like a daughter to me. And that's why I just can't let this go. No, no. Okay, bye. Where to go? Oh. 
that in a hot tub full of perfectly good dead hookers. Two more up here. However many is outside. Tight. Priscilla, what you've learned about doo doo. <laughs> it stinks. Yeah. <laughs> hey, doo doo, come here. Okay. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> so, you really fucked me in pre K. <laughs> so, my name was what these kids were still doing in their fucking pull ups. <laughs> if you've your matters, it's time you return the favor. Radovan doesn't like to wait much, does he? No, he does not. You'll come with us. Well, every other day there's an update for a fucking game. HMS Oxenford Tretador, once the crown jewel of the Redanian fleet. Decommissioned now, though. Nice boat. You'll need to leave your weapons if I'm to let you aboard. Follow me. <laughs> but you, but you have your weapons? Ladies from the most <laughs> prominent families gave up their jewelry. A spur of them. To truly All right, I can't cast country. either. Because if I can put my shield up, I'll fist fight these motherfuckers. The old Hadouken. Alright. Look at haymakers and uppercuts. There you are. Need something from me, Your Majesty? You've never been one to mince words. Very well. Find Philippa Eilhart. That's my wish. I ordered her eyes gouged out once. But apparently her blindness troubles her not. My hunters have detected Lady Eilhart hiding east of Oxenfurt. They have further established that she has magically sealed the entrance to her shelter. Entering it will be difficult. I believe you might succeed in doing so. Bring her to me. Alive. Philippa Eilhart. What's she looking for here? I suspect she wants to find her old friends. Reconvene the lodge. Perhaps she seeks revenge on me. Lady Eilhart is known for her persistence. At times, I recall the lessons she gave me when I was a child. Her teachings as memorable as the punishment she meted out. She was subtle and patient in her cruelty. I took her sight, but she remains dangerous. I'd advise you to be cautious. Philip is using magic. We'd be better off sending mages after her. I agreed to the Conclave's revival, but what has this brought me? The Majors at my side are mediocrities, cowards. They couldn't hold a candle to the likes of Eilhart, Loan Teal, or Merigo. There's always your witch hunters. You are the best witch hunter. You've proven it clearly. Sheila the Tangible and Philip Eilhart's plan. You were the one to foil it. Yeah, witch hunter, I'm a witch I want you to finish what you started. Now go to the mountains and bring me Philip Eilhart. Wait, 
still stuck here. Have you gone to that one mass grave thing? Yeah. yeah. Huh? Yeah, I still got my mask gray ball face mask on. <laughs> I was just button mashing, so I had accidentally kissed her. <laughs> I said I was just button mashing, so I had accidentally kissed her when she got all Sarah at the party. I drank one wine. Ooh, tipsy. Let's get naked. <laughs> I get off the fucking boat. I didn't see how I got on the boat. Do you see the other things? Oh. Is that? Oh. Well, that makes a little more sense. You're out. Thanks. Never seen better steel in my life. Blade must strike true, no? It's a matter of the hand, not the steel it's holding. Maybe you have a little bit of trouble. Pardon me, which you get off of Riffy? Yeah, what do you want? I have a message for you. Hang on. Who from? Read it. You'll know. Uh oh. Sir, who are you trying to keep, Jennifer or fucking Triss? I think I might have to stick with the redhead. Sure. Got a weakness for the redheads. Well, I think uh, Triss kind of left him too, right? No, he got his memory back. And he left her. Oh. Yeah. Um, I remember she had some part in his memory being gone still or not. There was something that happened to him. She probably that. did. She probably fucking wiped his memory. Well, I don't think she wiped his memory, but I think she probably prolonged it. I, I don't remember, though. It, it might not be. Yeah, but Unifer's trying to stuff like lobsters up his butt and stuff. Is that the only freaky thing you've seen with her really so far? Fucking one of the two times I've seen the bitch. Okay. 
Okay, you're not doing so many of the missions, and you should see them more than that. If you're this far already. Ah. What? So, you, you hadn't seen her sitting on like a horse thing or anything? Naked? You and her did it on horse or whatever? No. Nope, we didn't do it on the unicorn. A unicorn? Yeah, we didn't do it. I'm missing all the pussy. Apparently, I ain't fuck nobody. Why didn't you do that other girl before you killed her? I huh? told you that other witch girl. I ain't killed her yet. Kill her or whatever? Okay, so yeah, see, you're jumbling around or something then. Are you doing mainly storyline and not side missions or? Oh, uh, mainly. Okay, that's, that's probably the reason why. You gotta do them side missions too, because you would have done her already. You get some more shit from her too, but you need it. And then... I did kind of want to fuck Kira. Yeah? <laughs> I said I did kind of want to fuck Kira. Who's that? A dark-headed witch. Kira? I want to lose in a hut. I don't remember what... Yeah, when I showed you or whatever. Like you first we first made her she's in the bathtub. And her little grotto or whatever. Yeah, I'd have to look up and see. That's that's basically what I did is I went and I looked up on all the people <laughs> you could potentially have sex with. And how it would intertwine <laughs> and who you would choose to be with. And the main ones that cause I think there's like six girls. That's the, uh, the redhead and the other one also left. But it's between those two. I think you can bang the redhead once, I think, and not interfere with the other one. But I can't remember. You say you can bang the redhead once and not interfere with the other one? I <laughs> <laughs> Spend all my money on hoes. I do have that side mission for uh, Kira or whatever. Whoever she is, she's one of the people I banged because you can bang her. Uh, uh, I don't know who that is. It's from Blood and Wine storyline. Oh. Um, I don't think I've met her yet. Cyrena? I don't know. Also, I think I've got like three or four DLCs that come in my game, and you probably don't, so that might have to do with it also. 
Where is that goddamn quest? I think that's it. Corey said I can bang as many hoes as I want and it doesn't affect it. Instead of just fucking each other, fucks with them. I forgot who would fight who would win between Jennifer and Triss. Probably Jennifer. Yeah, Jennifer's pretty badass too, but. What? I don't know. <laughs> I didn't see Triss run out in the middle of no fucking combat <laughs> war zone. <laughs> Start eating motherfuckers or. Not personal, though, though I've seen you many times. I've a gift. I see the future. Yours as well. But not for free, I guess. I don't ask much. If you've a bite to eat. Okay, uh, Tris helped him recover his lost memory. That's what it was. Here. Thank you. A fine offering. Well worth a foretelling. All right, let's hear it. I see a white wolf. He looks on as the great viper bites and devours the silver lily. He wants to spring. He wants to fight. But the serpent is quicker. The lily must perish. That's not the future. Lived through that. And you probably heard about it in some ballad. My third eye grows foggier the older I become. But if you bought me some dragon's root... Rare plant. Rare indeed. But it did once grow in a cave southeast of here. Fine. I'll see what I can do. these options to not do shit for these fucking people and I still tend to fucking let me go get it. Can I get over this shit? Shit. 
Sword. Yeah, if you attempt to equally romance both Chris and Yennefer throughout the game, you will lose both. <laughs> yeah. Some people have tried to do the story some bit, and it does not work. <laughs> I think there's something else in this cave. Hey guys. Sadly, though, you know most people's first instinct is going to be try to have a threesome. Yeah, I mean, not necessarily a threesome, but try and romance both of them and try and keep both you can. Yeah. The folks in here. I'm sure doing it with two witches would be awesome. Maybe I can find another dragon's root, <laughs> just in case. Maybe fucking not. Shuffle up the hill. Gotta keep the even numbers. See a wolf striving forward towards a solitary tower midst a blizzard. He follows the swallow, yet the swallow does not heed the wolf's howls, soaring higher and higher, for it knows tis its last flight. So shall it be. Look for the signs. The world will perish amidst ice and be reborn with the new sun. Reborn of the elder blood of Hen Iker of a planted seed. If means prophecy, leave me be. Go. Go now. <laughs> Thanks for all the help, Vipjet.
think that is the one. something to do with it there, Corey. Okay, you can't see the harbors until you're on a boat, I guess. Really? How the fuck? Fuck the dog get up here. I was up there because I was pretty sure the dog couldn't get the fuck up there. Dresser. Oh, 
shit. I'm fucking splitting hairs on my horse over here. Shop I get down that hill, Bessie. kind of retarded sometimes. So I name them Roach. Grammars. Wait a minute. Hola. He does swim pretty fucking fast. down here over okay. there. Jesus Christ. Guys. 
Necrophage hides are uh, pretty valuable as well. Uh, what the fuck did she say? That's what I taught her. Peekaboo, motherfuckers. Apparently I can't run like this either. Tell up while I fucking hunt for ghosts. It's like a good spot for a ghost. Like a really good spot for a ghost.
turn these things into ghosts. <laughs> Didn't talk to them. liberating mission Like how you can't fucking run around or anything with the damn map. Come here, bitches. Ghost out here. more parts anyway. Ghost hunt. Yeah. Yeah, shut up, phone. Go for yourself.
I mean, there's a beehive or something. Or is it like ghost bees? Oh, they're not shit. There, <laughs> there they are. Quiet, fool. Babylon and the noble himself will hear you. Oh, wait. They're on to us. They're not letting Cray him in. Quiet, fool. Babylon and the noble himself will hear you. Nah, he sat his arse on silk pillows. Lightly be gobbling me. <laughs> We've no notion we he's coming to tear him to shreds. Waste clear, lads. Adam! What? Two? What are they for? Turn around some goats. About pissing myself. Come to daddy. Come to daddy. You miss me, bitch. I'm gonna cut your tongue out. Oh, wait. I can't do that right now. Someone's that shit. Come on, come closer. Damn it. Can I get this right? Green stone and everything. Mm -hmm. 
Where's that noble? Lying here, quiet as a mouse. Head split open like a rotted pumpkin. More like a peasant now. Sloshing around in his own blood and shite. Be nothing noble about him. Too quick a death they gave him. Should have been made to suffer. He's not the end of it. Sons can suffer for it. And the daughter. To the top! Uh, Alright. <laughs> a dick move. didn't come here to ask nicely. Yeah, I gather that, buddy. Place is full of rats. As many dead as alive. I think they're feeding on... Blood. Many must have died here. Somebody knocking? Nope. Don't start, Annabelle. Back to your craft. Always bending my ear about fool peasants. I'm not hearing them again. That simpleton turned your head. Start, Annabelle. Back to your craft. Always bending my ear about fool peasants. I'll not hear of them again. That simpleton turned your head. But one grail hardly makes you <coughs> courtly one and all. My lord, peasants, they're through the door in the tower. And my question is, why the fuck is all this furniture moving the fuck around like that? Like, I was looking at the damn ghost over there. Uh, uh, time to go. I'm sorry, you're on your own on this shit. <clears throat> chairs and shit now. Goddamn tower. something across the floor or dragged it from one wall to the other repeatedly
Creepy with the lamp. Mm. Looks like a laboratory. Pretty well equipped too. I mean, why did you leave? You claim to love me. I'm cold. Why has no one come for me? I cannot leave this place. I see no way out. Who are you? Do you seek to hurt me as well? I'm a witcher. I want to lift the curse that grips this island. Your turn to tell me who you are. The other ghosts, they couldn't see me. I'm special. Always was. The rare beauty. The Lord's daughter. These lands, as far as the eye can see, were ours. My family and I were hid in the Major's Tower to await the Hill's End, the end of hard times. It was not to be forever. Tell me what happened here. Peasants sailed to the island to ask for food. Is that true? No! They came to rob and kill! They thought us rich, believe we'd stowed ourselves away here to laugh at their misery. Yet we had little food as well. Too little to share with those who came. They slaughtered everyone. I heard my father cry out, but the mage told me not to reveal myself or let anyone in. He gave me a potion. If I was discovered, I was to drink it. He said everything would be all right. What kind of potion was it? Remember its smell, what it looked like? I remember only that I feared to drink it. Didn't trust the mage? In the village, they claimed she meddled in disease. Not curing it, but causing it. They said he lured rats into the tower, infected them with the Catriona. Only rumors, surely, but I was afraid. So horribly afraid. And then I heard him. My beloved Graham. He called to me. I opened the door for him, but others rushed in. They lunged at me and... and... Did they hurt you? They gripped my arms. Tore at my dress. I managed to free myself and drink the potion, and then... Nothing. Poison. That how you died? No. For I later awoke. I was alone. It was dark. Only there were rats. Everywhere. Dozens. Hundreds. And I... Couldn't move. Sleeping potion. Effects hadn't worn off yet. You were paralyzed. They were everywhere, all over me like insects. My face, my hands. I felt them rip open my skin, then crawl into my stomach. Hmm. Ouch. They tore me apart, and I could not even scream. Have I not suffered enough? Why can't I leave this place? the island's other specters? No, I'm alone here. The others, they flee when they see me. I know not why. You do not fear me, do you? No. Used to dealing with ghosts. Though, gotta admit, there's something about you. You're... different. You weren't the last to die on this island. Found a fresh corpse in the tower. The island's a dangerous place. Folks should not venture here. I too wish to leave. The dead man. Looked like a monster had attacked him recently. The tower home to anything else? How am I to know? There's lots of wraiths here. I, uh, I hear them whispering every night. 
Not talking about ghosts. A monster who hunts here. You must have noticed something. I don't know. I've noticed naught. Why do you ask? Why must you press me so? You ought to be my savior, not my tormentor. How can I help you? A curse born of hatred binds me to this place. Only love's power can hope to lift it. Who could love a race? And your beloved, he dead too? Graham? No, he lives. I would know if he died. But he fled and abandoned me. Left me here all alone. Maybe you could strip the curse of its power by forgiving him. You might cleanse the isle. As I see it, you're the curse's focus. The other ghosts on the island, their auras aren't nearly as strong as yours. My medallion started pulsating as soon as we started talking. I don't know what you mean, but you do seem to know some things. You could be right. My fate is tied to the Isle, I feel that. Perhaps because I am heiress of these lands. It could be your blood ties to the land. The base of the curse, that is. If so, forgiving Graham, laying your resentment to rest, should lift it. I... loved him. I'm prepared to forgive him. But I must know that he regrets what he did. Take my bones to him. He must bury them. This will be our farewell. Will you speak to him? Will you do this for me? Hell no. Hmm. Really sad story, but something's not right. Got a feeling. What is it? You're not telling me everything. You know the island's dangerous, but refuse to tell me about the monster that lives here. There is no monster. I think you're lying. The question is, why? To protect the beast? Or is it that... Stop! I will not hear this! I can't help you. Taking anything off this cursed island, from any cursed place, just too dangerous. And a dead woman's bones, that's asking for trouble. They said witches are hot as beasts. Will you bring Graham here then? I so long to say goodbye. Annabelle, listen. Do never wish to help me, and here I have someone who finally take pity on me. Mm -hmm. Gotcha, bitch. This got the rats after me too. Gotta catch this. What? Fucking come here, bitch. I ain't done with you. You have taken the boats. <laughs> this is, of course, we're going to the basement. Where you at, ho? Wait a minute. 
don't know if the boat's faster. Drivers to jump up on the boat with me. <laughs> Doesn't look like it. Yeah, Somehow or another, I believe I might be able to swim faster than this. I don't know. Diagram over there, I'm assuming it can get damaged and shit and break and figure that's what that's about. Well, this grand motherfucker didn't just go across the water and fucking live on the damn edge of the water. <laughs> like, I can still see the tower. I think it's raining. Splashing some water or something. Can you know about her? I met her. Talked to her. Annabelle's dead. Drank poison. And I... I couldn't oh, save her. It's a well. Did you love her? I... Something mad. Loved her so deep I believed we'd come through. Believed we'd be together. Of course. It was not to her father's liking. His daughter and a plain lout. What happened on Fike Isle? You gotta tell me. It's where Millie, Finch, and Faulkner, they rallied the men, all roughs, to go to the Isle, take back what was ours from the new group. They knew I was known at the tower, that the Lord's servants would open the gate for me as soon as I sold them fish. They forced you to go with them? No, I... I saw my chance in it. For Annabelle and me to flee. But... It all spun in a chaos. Our boys from the village, they started killing everyone. Annabelle, they wanted to rape. First, then she drank the poison. Mage was drinking the gator. <laughs> it's a funny story the tower, about the poison. It wasn't poison. To die, cursing them all she was still alive. Her. She got ate by rats. Don't force me to speak of it. <laughs> After you left her. No more, please. Yeah. <laughs> It wasn't a poison. Annabelle drank a strong sleeping potion. Mage wanted to protect her, make it look like she was dead. Convinced everyone. That means... Is she... You said you spoke to her? Spoke to her ghost. By the time she awoke, Tower was full of cold corpses. And rats. She was warm meat. Rats ate her alive. She was 
cold all through like a corpse. I shook her, begged to open your eyes. I never thought... Annabelle needs you. You can help her. She's still there. In the tower. Can I see her? Yeah. One thing you should know, though. In death, Annabelle turned into a pester. A pester? What's that? More than a restless ghost. A plague maiden. A powerful wraith filled with grief and hatred that drive her. Give her the power to sow disease and death. She suffers. How am I to help her? Got to know I'm willing. A curse has imprisoned Annabelle and the other spirits on the island. Love can shatter its power, free her and them. Just as in the legends. If you know the legends, you know one kiss is enough to break an evil spell. On one condition. But it's a kiss from someone whose love is true. I told you. I said I love her with all my heart. Take me to her, please. It's dangerous. There are risks involved. Understand that, don't you? Of course. I'm no coward. I'll not run this time. <laughs> I'm no coward. I won't run this time. Let's go. I'm ready. <laughs> so you damn right. You want to shoot you in the back of the head with a crossbow? Fuck around. Impossible. We could have been together, and now she's dead. You couldn't go and get on blue. It's my fault. If only I'd been able to protect her. Can't change the past, but you can still help Annabelle to move on, to rest in peace. <laughs> I guess we're uh, beyond the whole motherfucking ghosty and shit. It's too quiet. Chop, chop. Speed up. Let's get this over with. You remember the screams? Inhuman. Now it's silent. They're dead. All dead. Don't think Everybody's about that. Dead. Keep walking. Oh shit. <laughs> this is the big ass hole on the floor, I guess. You got the French kisser, bro. I was sure you was dead. If I'd known otherwise, I'd never have left you. I'd do anything for you. I would you. You know that well. Believe me, I beg you. Prove it. Uh, how? Kiss me. Graham, careful. Your 
bad dirt guy. Turn around my deer. Nice tooth, baby. <laughs> the curse is lifted. Got him. Graham and Annabella reunited. You ain't got nothing on you, bruh. No money, nothing. You broke, bitch. Yes. What that is? She goes up again. Captain there until the end. What a shitty way to die. 